Hey, my name is David of Weathington Photo. Thanks for checking out the video. I'm going to show you how to use my button template. Uh, the instructions are right here. The important thing to remember is the canvas size is about 3.25 by 3.25. Uh, you're going to use this same uh, cell size in Lightroom to print it. Uh, so make sure you don't mess with that too much unless you're really familiar with how to print. Um, so yeah, let's get, get right in. Our red layer is where our subject's going to go, which is right there. I have my subject here. You're going to put your subject here, your cutout here, and then you shut off mine. The orange layers are all the layers you can change. Uh, they are the hue saturation. Just double click on it and it brings it up. And you can change it to whatever color you need to. Go back to so your orange. That's all the layers you can change your color. So you can go through that. And you get your red, you get your orange. And the next one's going to be your text, which is all the yellow. Just double click on it, change it to whatever number you need to. Call it good. Um, if you have a, a longer name and you need to change it, you can um, just double click on it, change it, change it, and then you can change it to whatever you need to. Um, change it. Text size, longer names, you're going to need to change the, the, the size of it. But if you need to center it, just double click it. It'll bring up your little marquees here. Just go ahead and click that. And then you're going to hit your marquee, your M tool. Hit V. Come up here to this little double dash, and then it centers it for you. Um, so that's how you do that. Go back to where I was. Um, yep, that's it. So then what you're going to do is you're going to um, go up to File, Export As, go as a JPEG, save it to wherever you need to, and then you're going to open it up in Lightroom, which I've already done that. Uh, here's our cell size. You can go to Cells. I already have it set up to do uh, 3.25. If you do this, then that'll be roughly 3 inches. It's slightly larger. I have a video on how to use the button press I used to, but this is how you do the photo side of it. So once you do that, you just click print and then you're good to go. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Thank you.